Welcome back everybody to another food review here on Food Central TV. So someday last week I came to Wendy's after eating at Domino's for the night. Uh, I no longer work at Domino's. This past weekend was my last week. I quite frankly hated it. <laughs> so I finally got around to quitting. I got a promotion my, at my other job. So uh, it worked out that I could finally quit quit dominoes the tips were getting pretty non-existent but anyways so i was at wendy's last week and i saw they had a brand new sandwich on their menu which i was like hey i think i remember seeing somebody reviewing this once sometime last year so they were testing this in some locations last last year and they're finally rolling it out this month but it's not on their website yet but uh it's gonna be i think pretty much everywhere it's nationwide sometime this month so the brand new sandwich uh which you figured you know you read the title and this is really hot <laughs> it is the fresh mozzarella chicken sandwich it also comes in a salad form the sandwich i got just the sandwich by itself and with a, a cup of water was six dollars and seven cents with tax so you know kind of expensive ish uh, i didn't get the fries or anything because i wasn't in the mood for that and uh, I don't know how much the salad was. I didn't bother to look. But uh, they have some pretty cool ingredients on here. Uh, they have balsamic diced tomatoes, which apparently they do that twice a day. Fresh mozzarella, a creamy pesto, and um, chicken and a spring mix on a garlic brioche bun. And I'll be honest, I tried this already uh, the other day. So I kind of know what this is, what this is kind of like. And I had to wait... Sorry, this is really hot. I had to wait a few minutes extra for this because they had to make the grilled chicken. So hopefully this is really good and I'm getting really hot. I could probably keep the window down when I do these kind of videos, but eh, I don't. And actually, oh, look at that. It's kind of, mm, kind of wet, probably from being really freshly made or whatever. Let's try to lift this up. Okay, you can kind of see the tomatoes. You can see the spring mix, some mozzarella, and the chicken breast. Okay, there's the mozzarella right there. So, uh, let's take a bite. See how it is, even though I kind of know how it already is. <laughs> uh, oh, well. Mm-hmm. Really messy. Quite frankly, I'll be honest, like I always am. Uh, the last time I had it, I don't know what it was about it. I really didn't enjoy it all that much. But this first bite was overall way better than when I had it the first time last week. So I'll give it another bite, and we'll give it another breakdown. But this one is about ten times messier than when I had it last week. Mm. There goes the mozzarella. So what I do like about this, they took all the things they put on bruschetta and they put it on this, which is a, an Italian dish. It's kind of like on a piece of toasted bread or whatever. And they put the balsamic tomatoes and then they put some fresh mozzarella and some basil and stuff like that. I really, I really love that. And this kind of gives that essence of that. The balsamic, uh, the balsamic tomatoes are taste really good. Definitely getting that nice balsamic taste from that and some acid from that as well even though most of the flavor i think is from the from that and also that pesto sauce it kind of overpowering the the mozzarella just just a little bit when i had this last week they had put like just too much tomatoes on it and i think too much pesto sauce but this one has the perfect amount of all that on there the spring mix kind of not getting it doesn't really bother me all that much. The chicken is super fresh, really juicy. It's You should see the puddle of juices that are in the wrapper right here. So much juice. It's definitely tender, and the chicken has a very nice flavor. I love Wendy's chicken, one of my favorite fast food chicken. Well, grilled chicken, anyways. And then the bread, nice and soft, getting a little bit of the garlic flavor, not too much. But overall... I'd say it's a pretty good sandwich. Coming into this, I was going to say it was a decent sandwich, but this time, it was a whole lot better. I don't know what it is about it, but it was better than when I had it last week. So we'll take another bite, and I'll give it a rating, because that's what you do in food reviews. You eat stuff, and you give it an arbitrary rating. <laughs> So on a scale of 1 to 10, I will give Wendy's Fresh Mozzarella Chicken Sandwich, I'll give it a 
I'll give this an 8 out of 10. I probably would have given this a 7 last week, but this one was a whole lot better. Uh, the one bad thing I will say is that maybe there's too much pesto on there, which overpowers all the other flavors that I would have liked to have tasted. So maybe ask for light pesto sauce, for that way you can have a like, better balance of flavors. Because it's called the fresh mozzarella chicken sandwich, and you don't really taste the mozzarella all that much so maybe ask for extra mozzarella and light pesto maybe a little better but overall i love all the flavors the fresh tomatoes the balsamic vinegar well the balsamic dressing or whatever they had put on there adding a little little sweetness and a little acid and the tomatoes weren't mealy or anything they were really fresh i ate a few by themselves i could taste that they were really fresh the chicken also very fresh Overall, just a very good sandwich. Uh, a little, a little issue with like balancing of flavors and stuff, but you could easily, easily fix that yourself. But as always, thanks for watching. And if you like this video, make sure to hit that like button. And if you're new here and are not subscribed yet, make sure to hit that subscribe button. But that's it for me, and I will see you guys next time on my next video. See you next time, Connor out.